Ed here with the Digital Digest, and today I wanted to share a quick unboxing and first look at the Sabrent Rocket Extreme Q 8TB NVMe Drive. That's correct, your ears and eyes are not deceiving you. This is an 8TB external NVMe drive that supports uh, USB 3.2 connectivity as well as Thunderbolt 3. Basically the best of both worlds here in 2020, the most versatile external drive ever made. And Sabrent deserves uh, credit and props for doing this. As you can see on the back of the packaging right here, uh, up to uh, transfer speeds using Thunderbolt 3 of 2700 megabytes per second in USB 3.2, non-Thunderbolt 3 connectivity, we're talking about 900 megabytes per second. I mean, this is just an amazing thing. Uh, $1,500 is the retail pricing on this. So you certainly are paying for what you are getting. But again, try to find something that will match this. You will not. Now, Sabrin did have an extreme version of this drive. It seems to be discontinued at this point, And that's because, well, with the Q existing, why make a Thunderbolt 3 only version? And Sabrin also sent over their shockproof protector, which is something I shared with all of you back when they sent me a two terabyte version of this drive. So let's get it out of the packaging. Uh, this arrived uh, just in time for my birthday. Of course, there is no correlation between its arrival and my birthday. That's just the way it worked out. And I'm actually more excited about this than most other things I've been reviewing because this is bleeding edge. I mean, if there was anything out there that says bleeding edge, it's an eight terabyte NVMe drive that can essentially do everything. Now, um, I've covered the two terabyte version of this, and that's also a really good option if you're in the market uh, for a drive. I mean, I, I stand behind Sabrent's products. Granted, we have a relationship, but it's one that exists because Sabrent is really making some of the most innovative uh, storage uh, dr you know, devices on the planet right now. I've said it once, I've said it twice. In fact, I don't know how many times I've said it, but Sabrent is just hitting them out of the park with these drives because no one else is innovating here in 2020. First thing you will be greeted with, I'm not saying Samsung dropped out of the game, but it seems like Sabrent picked up the torch and set Sammy on fire. Uh, instructions to essentially enable uh, full potential performance on this. I've done a video about this. You basically just have to jump into the device manager and once you're in there, select properties, it's all on here, uh, you will get this. And then once you're inside, you gotta go to the policies tab and change it from quick under the removal policy to better performance and then enable write caching and you're in business. Now, love the fit and finish of this. It's pretty tight in there, very tight actually. And these are high demand. They are, I don't think they're manufacturing a tremendous amount of them and for good reason, again, Eight terabytes, uh, 1500 US dollars is not for everyone. Uh, and it's just crazy when you think about it that this is eight terabytes of the fastest storage on earth. And I mean, I've got a ton of mechanical eight terabyte drives for general backup. And I don't can't tell you that I ever thought I would see a day where I'd be holding eight terabytes in a portable form with no compromise. And I'm not saying there's a perfect drive. I'm gonna benchmark it. We're gonna put it through its paces. That'll be in a follow-up video very soon um, after the birthday celebrations are over. But, uh, cause you know, gotta do what you can during a pandemic, right? And try to celebrate. But this is just, I cannot believe it. You know, it's something I was waiting for Sabrent to send my way for quite some time. And I'm just glad that it is finally here because this is a game changer. Uh, included, of course, we've got the applicable cables that you would expect. Uh, and if I'm correct, we're going to have a Thunderbolt 3 and a USB 3.2. And that's exactly what we've got. So here we have the Thunderbolt 3 cable, fairly actually decent length on this, more than I was expecting. And then we have a type C to type A for the 3.2 connectivity. So uh, that covers all the bases you're going to need. And then this, um, I highly recommend, it's a shockproof protector for these drives, uh, but it's also great for heat dissipation. Uh, so, because when you're really putting these drives to work, uh, at least with the two terabyte, uh, what I've experienced is that they do get hot and they should. I mean, it's 
you know, there's only so much you can do with thermals on these. I mean, uh, Sabrent does go out of their way to keep these as cool as possible, uh, but you want to not, of course, worry about having to pick up the drive while it's under load and it being too hot to the human touch. So this is a, a double function for me at least. So it's not just about the shockproof capability, which you do want for a drive like this, because remember it's a $1,500 uh, piece of kit, but it's also, maybe I'll go the other way, but it's also really important uh, to have it for just not you know, getting burnt because these things do get really hot under load. Um, you know, when I've, with the uh, four terabyte uh, extreme drives uh, that I have from Sabrent, you know, when you're transferring, again, two, 300 gigs, they're going to heat up. That's just a fact of life. But you will never do it in the time uh, with any other drive on the market, especially this eight terabyte, because there just is nothing else for it to compete with. So really excited that Sabrent sent this over. Again, um, you know, this is to me, the most compelling piece of tech that I'm, I'm really covering outside of the Z Fold 2, uh, which is my daily driver, my phone. Uh, and that's because this is just, this is, we're, we're on another planet now, folks. I mean, this changes whether you're doing video, photo editing, or just mass dumping of data. This is a game changer in every way. So, Again, just happy it's here. I've been waiting a long time to get my hands on one of these eight terabyte drives because I know it's gonna change the way I work. It's gonna change the way I play. It is a jack of all trades and we're gonna see how it performs. You know, I'm not gonna pretend it's perfect. I do have to test it. We've gotta see where it hits the wall, if it hits the wall, at how many hundreds of gigs it starts to slow down because I already know how the Extreme Q line performs from, as I mentioned, the two terabyte that I have over here on the other half of the studio desk here. And uh, just excited to share it with all of you because again, uh, there's nothing else like it on the market. So there it is, eight terabytes of NVMe, Thunderbolt 3 capable uh, storage that also of course is compatible with, with USB 3.2. So you have the best of both worlds in one drive with more storage than many of you may need for a lifetime. Any questions or comments, please feel free to post them. Please. Feel Please feel free to subscribe and please stay safe. Later.